So Harvey, I was wondering if you could explain to me what will it look like for my generation when I'm 40 or 50 years old if there's no more ranching in our region and, and how it will really hurt our families and our growing community. We in Alberta here, can you believe it or not, in 20 to 30 years we could be uh, a, a net importer of food in Alberta and so you, th you think about that because that's what the numbers are showing us with the loss of land that we've had and the number of people that we have as a population we're supporting on our uh, grain and food producing lands. For any country, if you don't have your own food supply, you really lose your sovereignty. You lose your independence if you don't have your own food supply. That's, that's the first concern you should have. And the next concern, of course, is that we have to learn how do we maintain that land base. We have to learn as cities and towns that we have to go up, we can't continually to sprawl out. People don't realize that only 5% of the area of Canada is capable of producing food. Today we have uh, well over 80% of Albertans live in an urban setting and so don't have a great understanding of where their food comes from. We have to maintain our natural capital of food and water to be able to support our population.